I mean, you say Whoa. innovation, right? Innovation right there. They, they brought the entire zoo with them, right? They brought in a, ta a Taurus. They brought in the monkey itself. I don't know whether Sun is actually a good idea because keep in mind, if you're really close together uh, to the targets of these explosive crossbow shots coming in from Aerofell, yep. like that crit is going to spread around like almost literal wildfire. So I'm interested to see whether this is, again, a double-edged sword for the side of MPXNC. Martis will be pretty good in the early to mid game, but this is very interesting. Now, <laughs> we noted that Hanzo was one of Sonic's pocket picks, but I actually, th if I don't remember incorrectly, Sun was also a pocket pick back in that era for this player. So, it's gonna be very interesting to see. Now, he doesn't necessarily have to go for team fights, he can just split push. This hero is so good at split pushing, and he's not really vulnerable to Kaja either because, well, he just splits into multiple monkeys and you can't lasso them all. <laughs> I mean, well, as of right now, I would expect that Sonic is gonna need at least three of his items before he starts getting relevant here. And also, a consideration, I'm not sure when he's actually going to get the Great Dragon, uh, the Great Dragon Spear, right? I'm expecting him to get it probably second, maybe even third item, depending on what he wants to go for, but that's assuming he wants the crit. Yeah, that's assuming he even goes for the Great Dragon Spear in the first place. There's lots of other items that Sun may want to prioritize. Iris, though, yeah, that's first blood. I mean, just trying to go and turn around a big 5v5 team fight, and Iris is about to hit four! Yeah, Iris just hit four! Yeah, Iris just hit four. Turtle goes over Team Hot. We want manipulation to be used as well. Gary doesn't get to decimate. He'll trade one for one so far. As high on the runs, getting gunned down. Yura with the double kill to start things off. One thing to note about the history of NC is that this team was regarded as the blacklist Malaysia, especially in the tier two, because they liked going Ube strats. We don't see that as much now since Mali is not joining them on the roster, but they've always had a slightly weaker early game as compared to other MPL teams. Four members around the area. Around that area, flicker mm -hmm. forward, yeah, 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 getting a cash, and there it is, the Minoan Raid! Unleashed! But Team Hawk gets the turtle anyways, they do lose Jura. He's not gonna get taken down, especially before Panda gets more items. Hawk, we caught a position already, needs help, Panda's zone also locking Zap in place. Hawk's gonna fall, the real woman is gonna be there, decimate from Gary oh. on the E, but it doesn't really matter. Yes, man, Sun is not a hero that's gonna really start ganking and racking up kills from the start, because he needs items. This is a hero that wants to farm up, and until he can get that, we're going to see Sonic be pretty uninteractive on the map. While Sonic that's is powered level from E all the way back up, wait, hold on, Hulk's hold on. Hulk's gonna get kidnapped, don't on the two of them. Iris won't be able to finish off any kills, Team Hulk really wants the tier one, no more minions available. Yeah, yeah, gets the wave, trying to pop Ooh. memory, no finishers on the... Iris is going to be found out first. Noir, he's going to steal, Hawk will knock him up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But his body in the front, but Team Hawk will get a free Lord, no contest again. But while that was happening, look at Sonic. Oh, he's just making quick work, Sonic, Ooh. the Demolisher. Meanwhile, yeah, 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 finally dragged back, finished off by Gary. Team Hawk getting a kill and now looking Wait. to take the mid-tier one. Penalty Zone is going to be used as well. But the um, real Sonic is will still going. Back. Sonic is still pushing. MPX and Z just needs to stop the recall. It's Gary. He finds a killing spree. But I would say Sonic is dealing massive damage to Team Hawk's base. Can they get uh, him though? Yura, you can't win the 1v1. Not against this monkey. Uh, Sonic now surrounded by four members. Surely he goes down. And of course he does. Gary finishes him off. At this point, we can see MPX and Z in a lot of danger here. A good disengage from Zaz. And there it is, Noir. Ends up going oh. down the knock up. It's gonna be down to Panda. No follow up for MPX and see as Iris hits the back line with the penalty zone. Hawk protecting his buddies as Iris he's soaking out the damage like a sponge. MPX and see they just do not have the output to finish him off. And yeah, 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 ends up dropping. Iris still alive. Mentioned the Iris. This man is a problem. And he's just being the front line. And yeah, 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 just gets kidnapped instantly. Forced to use the ultimate, Iris gets two with the penalty zone, and Panda is just firing away with the heavy crossbow. Iris is unkillable. Team Hawk finding yay, 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 but most importantly is that this Lord is pretty much secure. If Sonic, I mean, when does he need to show up? Because I feel like there's not much time. Perhaps Gary will be the target to go for Sonic clearing out this Lord, but Gary's gonna slowly deal with it and his doppelgangers, that is going to take a while, and Sonic is just, he just can't stay there. Well, 
for now, uh, you would imagine that he can't stay there, but honestly, he doesn't mind. He, as long as he distracts this Lord for as long as possible and uses his doppelgangers to buy and stagger this bottom side wave, it allows people like the rest of his team to actually clear up the mid as well as get the first wave down onto the top side of the map. And now, Sonic, oh, take the Lord. Sure, I'll take the second wave, a second minion wave of a Lord empowered minions, and now I'm going to keep circling around you. All they need to do is to deal with the Lord, but that Lord will deal with the bottom inhibitor first. Gary is losing a 1v1 against Sonic, by the way. And he might end up going down, and he does. Damn! Sonic with a solo queue against Gary. And now MPXNC will have some burst of confidence taking care of the Lord, keeping two inhibitors alive, and you can see the mass recall from Team Hog. They're like, Especially Sonic as well. The Sea Halberd on the Sun now means that even the tankier members of Team Hawk are going to have a bit of difficulty going for that 1v1. And Sonic is definitely preparing to go monkey mode Ryan, on he's shove out the bottom wave to try and buy some time, but that Lord is dropping real fast. And yeah, 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 he needs help right now. He's really super low. That's the immortality, but it's a bit too late. Team Hawk already got the Lord without any contest. I mean, no one fury gets a three man knockout, oh! but they need the damage. Panda does end up dropping, thankfully, and Sonic now gets to go to town. Now and that we're at the 18 minute mark, this is late game territory. This is where Sun is the most annoying because it actually is really difficult to get on top of him. He does a surprising amount of damage as well. Super and it's slippery. Oh, wait, hold on. The conceal, the conceal. Yeah, they saw the conceal. Ooh. Who are going in for the drag bag against Hyde. They use the room with the bleacher. But no one. Flurry is just enough Panda! Oh, you die again! Hyde does go down, but Hog will respawn with the immortality. Gary, he's gonna try to go for his recall to survive, and he will make it back, but Zaz still but alive. Look at bot lane. Iris dealing with yeah, yeah, yeah. Bottom lane pushing in. Iris caught out in the open. Girls is trying to be there. Iris taking care of all the torn up memory. Not enough once more. Iris survives. Their health, in fact, it may even it might go down to that wave. Wait. They're still fighting though. Wait, it's gonna wait, go down. Wait, wait. I mean, look at Panda. Oh, he just barely survives. This Iris. might be a back door. There's Iris a split point They gotta go back right now. You see the recalls already, but I think Panda is gonna stop with this game, oh, Panda. Mighty <laughs> fight at the end. Oh my goodness. Catch him two times, but it doesn't matter. Panda running it down for game one. It, it was, it was, it was right there. It was so tantalizing. I was thinking in my head, like, man, you're right. These waves are getting a little too far in. Looks like FBX NC didn't want to deal with it, and immediately Team Hawk is like, this is backdoor angle. Let's run it, boys. How do you let that happen? You can't <laughs> let that happen. How did you let that happen? Running a draft that is supposed to do the yeah. exact same thing. <laughs> You have the Sun, you have the Brody, you're the one supposed to be taking turrets, not them taking them from you. MPX NC, it's back to the drawing board for them. There were so many mistakes that could have been fixed in that game, but definitely some interesting ideas. They just need to refine it right now.